Abigail! Jack! Anyone here? Anyone home? Oh, darling. I never thought I'd see this day again. You no good hillbilly piece of shit! I thought you was dead! I thought you was dead, John, huh? Where you been? Where you been? You know where I've been, darling. You know. You saw Dutch, didn't you? Yeah, I saw him. And Bill? Yeah, I saw him too. And you didn't go back to him? I left that life. Just as you left yours. How'd they treat you? Oh, I can take care of myself, John. One guard got funny on me one time, but I wasn't so ladylike, and he didn't try it again. Nor no one else. How's the boy? Oh, like you. And like me. Well, he's like a kid growing up without a father. That ain't fair. What is fair? Well, some trees flourish, others die. Some cattle grow strong, others are taken by wolves. Some men are born rich enough and dumb enough to enjoy their lives. Ain't nothing fair, you know that. We tried to change, I mean, ain't that what you're supposed to do? We did change, and it's over now. Jack! Jack, come here, boy. Hello, sir. Come here. How you been? Coyotes ate all the chickens, and poachers took the cattle. I tried, Father. I tried. I know you did, son. I know. And don't you go blaming me, boy. Don't you go blaming me. I ain't blaming no one, old man, but since you're still alive, there's four mouths to feed. And no cattle. That's a nice way to greet somebody. Why don't I get to warm and tender embrace? Consider the fact I ain't put a bullet in you your embrace, old man. You were supposed to look after the place. I did. Well, I did my best. Thing is, there was too many of them. Uh, I thought you was dead. I wasn't drinking. Hold your excuses until you figured out which one to use. Jack, go get your bags packed, boy. We got work to do. We're leaving in the morning. Go on. Yes, sir. Where are you going? Well, it's getting kind of dark now, but in the morning we've got to go get ourselves some more cattle. I've got friends at McFarland's ranch. It's over in Hennigan's stead who can sell us some. Now, Abigail, I hope you learned to cook. Yes, didn't I say, rather than some prison, they actually kept me incarcerated in a cooking school for young ladies. How do you do? Are you ready? Let's haul out. Come on! How you feeling, Jack? We got a decent ride ahead of us. I met him while I was away. 
The McFarlands are good people. We need folks we can trust right now. I was sick and they looked after me. Let's go! What? Let's go! a face I thought I'd never see again. Some of our public servants in Blackwater sent you back on another homicidal errand to protect and save us from Lord only knows what. Thankfully not, sir. I was hoping you might still be able to sell me some cattle. My boy, it would be a pleasure. Money's out the crowd now. She'll be more than happy to help you. <laughs> Take care now, Mr. McFarland. Good luck. I said I'd be back when this was all over, Miss McFarland. After the barn fire, you remember? Of course I remember. I just didn't believe a word of it. So, you've come for some cattle? Yeah, I'm finally starting up my farm again. Or trying to, at least. You'll be fine. You've been taught well. Come on, then. Without a drink in my hand. Boom. So, is this your boy? Yeah. Say hello to Miss McFarland, Jack. Hello. Ah, the arrogance of youth. He gets a little fur on his lip, and he thinks he knows best all of a sudden. <laughs> Must take after his father. Let's go. She's well, I think. We haven't had much time to talk yet. Easy. How's the ranch? Looks like you got him under control. I bet you back to call. Nice to see you again, Miss McFarland. And thanks for oh, everything. Jack, let's get him through the river. Slow down. Whoa. You're doing a good 
job, son! Just lead him straight up the hill towards home! Will do, Pa! Let's go! Come on, easy up now! That's all of it. Jack! Wait there! I'm coming! You all right? You're not hurt, are you? No. I'm fine. I'm fine. I, I wasn't scared, honest. Sorry you had to see that, son. Those men won't be stealing from anybody else. All right. Let's round up the stragglers and get moving. Come on! Love you, son. Thanks, Paul. That's got to be more exciting than those books of yours. Nice work, son. We made it. You did real good out there. Go on. Get your horse away from me by the stable. That's a fine herd we got ourselves. So we're ranchers? Did a good job, son. Nice shooting. Thanks, Paul. Make a rancher of you yet. <laughs> 